Yeah. Isms is everywhere. Sexism, racism, or ageism, or discrimination against people who are disabled. They call that abilityism. Discrimination against people who don't hear. We call that autism. That's everywhere. And again, when you become friends with a person or you work together with them, then the resistance decreases. Deaf babies are born with all of the capabilities, the potential in life if they have full access to information, communication, family language, especially language. The United Nations has a convention on human rights for people with disabilities, and it includes the right to sign language for all. We want them to grow up bilingual, meaning sign language plus reading and writing at a grade level. It's important also for society, for the emotional development of the children, to have contact with other people like themselves deaf people who are adults or with other deaf babies and children because children learn from each other. So I would really like to see more and more inclusive school programs. But at the same time, you have to think of what the deaf child needs. The deaf child should have a Bill of Rights, educational rights, that includes teachers who can communicate in that child's language. Include critical mass of others, sign language users or deaf children. Hearing children are okay, but what's great about being hearing? Maybe 80% of what they learn is through everyday interactions with other people, other children. So full inclusion includes that.